Drunk driving has always been a major concern in communities across America, and Northwest Minnesota is no different. Jackson Bruner tells us how a Wednesday event addressed the problem. Recalling the night of October 4th, 2014 was tough for Corin Hill to do as six beers spread throughout an innocent enough night in Roseau County turned into a harrowing arrest. The arresting officer actually did a double take when he read the machine. I blew a point two six more than three times the legal limit. Minnesota's traffic safety stakeholders heard every detail during the Toward Zero Deaths presentation. I had consumed six beers in eight hours and it took another 12 hours for all of the alcohol to be vacated from my system. Hill's license was suspended for a year and she owed thousands in fines. The situation taught her a great deal and reminded everyone in the room of the need to fix the issue. A new program out of Duluth called Joyride provides those who have had a few drinks with some options. Driving for Safe Communities is a local coalition that kind of drives the Joyride force. Bars in our local area can choose to participate in it and purchase vouchers that allow their patrons to get a safe ride home if they need it. It's an idea that MnDOT says could be used in Bemidji. You look at the counties in northwestern Minnesota, we consistently have higher DWI rates, higher fatalities that involve um, that uh, involve alcohol-related crashes. And, and so it's, it's really an important thing, an important statistic. And, uh, and anything that anyone can do to reduce those is, is going to be a help. Hill wants communities to pay attention and find ways to keep drunk drivers off the road so they don't have to go through the same things she still lives with today. I could have caused a fatality, whether it be mine or an innocent bystander. I was on the road at midnight. That's what time our school dances let out. There could have been my daughter in someone's vehicle. I, I, I can't explain the horror when I think about that, that I could have caused that. MnDOT statistics say Beltrami County saw 29 car crash fatalities in 2015. That's the most in northwest Minnesota, ahead of only Polk County, which had 26. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.